according, brother, in, in the gospel according to John. In the gospel of in the gospel according to John, chapter 17, verse 1, in the Bible it said, Jesus, he looked towards heaven and prayed. Who did Jesus pray to? Who? First of all, no, he is the angel. Who? 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 Father, I am not praying for the world, but only those that you gave to me. So your God That's Jesus one. Pray. Two. Hey, you mentioned, it. now my turn. Now I'm going to ask you a the question about Quran. Is Here is the Quran. Oh, hey, can you not I see? Not hey, we sent the devils oh, upon oh, these oh, believers. Oh, Oh. This is Quran. Oh, Allah sends devils oh, upon it's this believer. Hey. What kind of mercy Excuse of God me. that is? Excuse me. That sends okay, you can devils this upon okay. these believers. Okay. Okay. Again, hey. to slight them with evil. What here. kind of oh, yeah. Allah Stop is in heaven who sends oh, devils? I feel no Allah. I feel no Allah. He's your master. He's your master. Okay. Free, free. That is the run. Free, you cannot see. We send devils. Okay. Okay. What are you using in refuting this gentleman? Answer this. Answer this. Answer. 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 That's Quran, I'm telling you. Are you using the reason and logic? Yes. Are you a Christian? Oh, are you? Wait a minute. No, I'm not a Muslim. Answer. Christian. Address my Why? point. Uh, no matter. Address my me. point. You have an okay. Address okay. my point. So, did Jesus pray? You're not answering my point. Did Answer. Jesus pray? Answer. I told you. Yeah. The words that he would say. Of course he did. did. He Jesus showed us an angel. This is a child of all men's body. How your God Jesus prayed. Yeah. He oh. showed us how to pray. Oh, Jesus he wanted... came here oh, to Jesus. show us how hey. to pray. Does now your... answer hey. my question. Your Why would your merciful God send devils upon these believers to smite them with evil? Answer. Why does it say answer. that? Answer. Quran. Oh, you don't even know your Quran. Oh, 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 and now hey, you don't hey, know Quran. Hey, now you don't know Quran. You're making yourself a joke. You're making okay. yourself a joke. Yeah, he's a joke. That's Quran. That's Quran. Yes. How is that? How is a merciful God? He's your master. He's your master. I'm scared. Yeah. Does your hey, Christian, does yeah. your God Jesus have a father? Yes. How God has a father. Well, what do you mean? You ever heard of Almighty? Daddy. Almighty. Daddy. Almighty. Daddy. Nothing is impossible for the Father. Ah. It's impossible for Allah. No. Because no. Allah cannot have okay. cannot have because Allah does not have a partner. Because no. Allah, Allah because Allah was created okay. from no. the realm. Let me finish. Oh, hey, hey. Let me finish. Allah was created in the realm of afterthought out of perfection and peace. But okay. this entity has okay. no partner. Okay. 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 Allah okay. is a deity Excuse Excuse of the me. lower Excuse realm. Excuse me. Excuse me. You are a Muslim? Yes, yes. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Did Mother of Jesus, Maryam, pray? Yes. Pray. Salah, pray. Yes, yes. Okay. Did Mary pray? What's your question? Yes, she did pray. So what? Okay. Not okay. only she okay. prayed. Okay. These are the okay. words of, of okay. Mary and whom you revere. Okay. Oh God, make me a tool okay. to your will. Okay. Okay. And and what what happened was okay. annunciation also of the Messiah who already existed did. to come. Mary was merely a vehicle, no, not a vessel, question. a vessel okay. in way, through which okay. Christ came not into this no world. Question. Did Mary pray to God Jesus? Of course not. No? No. Oh, was Jesus God? Yes. So Mary did pray to God? She prayed to the God 
that is revealed to the scriptures through the, of the holy prophets. So what is that you don't understand? She was a Jewish woman. How? So she was How? she was praying uh, okay. and she was stopped. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> Did Mary give birth to Jesus? Yes, and here is another uh, surah from Quran. Through Spirit God. of God hey. that Jesus came into this world. Okay. That's in your Quran. Uh, through Jesus Spirit born. of Baby God. Born. Oh, you do not see. Okay. It's through the Spirit of God with God and chastity. Okay. It is God's Spirit okay. Okay. that made it happen okay. according to Quran. Okay. Look it up. Okay. Find it. Find okay. it. Find okay. it in Quran. Okay. Find it in Quran. Listen, Find it in Quran. Listen, listen, so listen, who is listen, the father of Jesus according to Quran? Listen. Who is the father of Jesus according to Quran? No I just one. told you. Yes, no one. No one. No one. How about that for logic? How about this for logic? Okay. For? Okay. I just told okay. you. It was God. It was God. It was God. God is his father. That's why she was born. That's why she was a virgin. Read Quran. You understand Quran, yes? Fake bear. Fake bear. You read Quran? Excuse me. You read Quran? Read bear. No, no, no. Read Quran. Read Quran. Read Quran. Read Quran. I challenge that. I challenge that. I challenge that. I challenge that. Okay. 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 Allah is not my master. Allah is not my master. I don't fear your God. Your God is a lower God, not the most high. Christian, I fear no Allah. Christian, sexual, sexual. Christian, you like it? You like it like boy? Allah will give you a hundred points. Don't worry. You, 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 you are talking to him. Excuse me. Did you can you read it in English? Okay, 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 okay. Hey, hey, did you read it, Brother, Jesus, Jesus, Brother, Okay, brother, okay. Brother. Another go over there, debate going on. Okay, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, you be quiet. We are talking. Loud, loud. No, I want you to read loud. To prove that you know nothing about your Quran. I will prove it. Loud. That's what he wants. He wants to read that. So take him over there. No, no, no. Let's go! Okay. This is the Western world. Okay. This is the Western world. Get your monkey behind your fucking shit. Don't behave like a monkey yourself. Okay. Can you read it? No, no one of you can read this. You can read this Quran. But you, you claim to read the Quran. We are talking. He's finished with you. He's finished. No matter. He's speaking. He's speaking. No matter. From this side, one more speaking. Okay. Excuse me. You didn't address any of my points. You didn't address a single of my points. Answer my point. Why Allah sends devils upon these believers according to Quran? Why? Tell me why. Answer anyone. Please answer. Why would Allah send devils upon these believers? Anyone can answer that. No, you don't want to answer about Quran. I'm talking about Quran. Why are you walking away? Why are you walking away? Anyone? Why Allah sends devils upon these believers? Anyone? Anyone? 
No one. What do you want me to understand? Thank you. Dad, yes? Yes. Who is he saying to? Prophet, if you are in doubt, so that means Muhammad was in doubt. No, no. no it's not saying conditional. Okay, you're gonna answer my question. I answer your question. You asked me to just pray. I told you how we pray. Now answer my question. Yeah, this is good enough. Don't worry, they they don't know. Go ahead. Answer my question. Answer my my question oh, now. Oh, I answer most of your questions. How many answers did you answer? Mine? How many answers you okay. 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 gave me? Hold on. 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 Did Why? Jesus have a stepfather? Stepfather. So with Joseph. Him, yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. I oh, stop. So I answer what? your question. So Hear the record. I answer your question. Now answer my question. Now answer my question. Answer my question. Why Allah sends devils upon these believers? Why Allah Why Allah sends devils upon these believers? Answer. Yes, it says that. Oh, you do not see. We send devils upon these believers and we smite them with evil. I, on the record, I answer your question. Answer my question. Okay. What? Okay. I don't know. 19. You just saying yourself? I remember what number. Numbers make difference. Why are you walking away? Because you answer don't answer the question. Ask God. Ask God. Go back. Go back to the Ask God. 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 Ask Oh, what? What? Oh, yeah. 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 Do it. Oh, I'm so. asking you. No, I'm asking you. Why Allah sends devils to this believers? Answer. Are there devils? Are there devils? Are there devils? Go on the boat, paddle back, go on the boat, paddle back, go on the boat, paddle back, is this how you pray? Is this how why Allah sends devils from this river? If Jesus was God, answer the question. If Jesus was God, answer the question. 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 Why would he pray? Answer the question. On the record. Answer the question. Okay, this is going nowhere. Answer the question. Answer the question. Oh, 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 no, 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 no,
Why would merciful God send devils upon these believers? Okay. Okay. Yes. Let's go. Why? Why? Let's get on. So there you go. There you go. There you go. That's Quran. That's Quran. That's Quran. I just told you. You know nothing about Quran. Nothing. Nothing. So any any Muslim wants to discuss it? I challenge any Muslim okay, of Quran. Any Muslim. <laughs> Why are they? What happened? Is that the best of Islamic produce here? Are you Muslim, sir? Please come. You look like a Muslim. Please come. Please. My suggestion is the Quran demonstrates that Allah is ignorant about the Bible. He is ignorant about the Bible. I'll give you one example. How many of you Muslims know about the story of Dulkarnayn? How many? Have any of you heard about Dulkar 9? Muslim. What a Christian. Fuck you. Oh, nice. Fuck you. That's, Fuck you. Gandu. That's a very Gandu. thing to do. Gandu. 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 If you are in legal trouble, you need to find someone else. Now. You are a Muslim, sir. No, Please no, no, come no, on up. No, no. How many of you Muslims? Oh, no, no, no. no, no. no, no. no, no. 
How many of you? I am not scared to admit that in public. When you know, liar, liar, liar. Liar, liar, liar. All right. Not selling much clearly. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Just shouting out to sell it a bit more. Yeah. All right. <laughs> For anyone who is a sensible Muslim, who I have is a bold enough to face the challenge. I have a question. I'd really like to extend an invitation to come over here. I have a question. What I'm going to talk about Shut up. is this person called Bulkar Naib. Please pay for I've told you multiple times. Bulkar Naim. The word Bulkar Naim means the one with the two horns. You, sir, try and engage. The one with the two horns. Yandu. Yandu. The one with the two horns. The point is the one with the two horns. Hey, Baya, Kisa, Kisa. The one with the two horns, the Quran claims, traveled from one end of the world to the other end. Thank you. Surah Al Kaf, Surah 18. Al Kaf, there is no Surah. Talks about Bulkar 9 going from one end of the world to the other end. Motherfucker! Bulkar 9 being the one with the two horns. Sorry, to carry? Any Muslim who is willing to face the challenge. But you know what? In claiming Bulkar Naim as someone who's traveled from one end of the world to the other end, it makes a primitive historical mistake long after the incident has happened. If you know anything about context, essentially, essentially, the Quran, Allah, introducing to Muslims. Go, 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 just there, brother. Just there, just there. But turn around. All right. And
but others who are of the, of, unfortunately on the side of accumulators and seem to think that this is okay. I'm going to read this as well. This is also from the Roman Catholic Church. And these are the dogmas within the Maryland Church. It says here, the Immaculate Conception. The most blessed Virgin Mary was from the first moment of her conception by singular grace and privilege of Almighty God and by virtue of the merits of Jesus Christ, Saviour of the human race, preserved immune from all stain of original sin. Now can you show me where in the Bible any other person was preserved from, human, from original sin other than the Lord Jesus Christ? Can any Roman Catholic do that? Because I'd argue if you can't do that, then we're talking about extant biblical tradition being preached in the Roman Catholic Church. I mean, this is a dangerous heresy. We're not just talking about some people who believe in Christ. We're talking about people who claim to believe in Christ and yet believe there's another mediator between man and God. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to quickly talk about this because it's important. You Protestants out there, whoever you are, if you believe in Christ alone for your salvation and you believe the Bible is the word of God, know that Bob does not believe in this. Bob does not believe in this. He's a Roman Catholic. Okay? I'm going to read what the Roman Catholic Church teaches about salvation. It says here, furthermore we declare and proclaim, we define that it's absolutely necessary for salvation that every human creature be subject to the Roman Pope. Did you just hear that? So I have to be subject to the Roman Pope to be a Christian. And we're supposed to believe that these people are Christians. We're supposed to believe they believe the same Lord as us. And yet their coward defendant can't even address the claims we've made. No, it's how they've run, because they can't address it. Yes, we can run to Muslims. Yes, we can talk about Sahih Bukhari and the pictures thereof. Yes, we can talk about Mohammed being a pedophile. Yes, we can do all that stuff. But the moment you want to go to big boy stuff and deal with actual Christians, you run for your life. That, that goes to show you something. This is a cult we're dealing with, my friends. And everybody watching, we're dealing with a cult. Because the Bible clearly says, always be willing to give out hope for the defense of the hope that's within you. So Bob has ever, every chance to deal with the documents we are bringing to him. He's not going to. I'm going to read out more of the Bible in regards to ecumenism. Again, ecumenism, if you truly believe in that, is a heresy from Satan. And I would implore you to reconsider even preaching. This is what the Bible says in regards to unbelievers like Bob. And if any man obey not our word by this epistle, note that man, this is 2 Thessalonians 3.14, and have no company with him, that he might be ashamed when the Roman Catholic Church teaches that the Mary, Mary is the media church all graces, and the Eastern Orthodox Church teaches that you can only be saved by venerating icons, you can get this up online, I don't have any reason to lie to you at all. If these churches are teaching this, what are they teaching? Are they teaching the gospel of saving grace? That through Christ alone you can be saved? Or are they teaching another gospel? We've heard what the Bible says about another gospel. You adulteress, and I want, I want to tell this to people who love Bob and adore him and watch him. I say this to you, what demon are you of? Because I don't love Bob, I've known him for three years. I love him in terms of a brother with worlds, yes. It's because to love all men, but I don't adore him. I don't adore his doctrine. Do I pray for him? Yes, of course I pray for him, because we should be praying for him. Is that not intercession though then as well? You're no. praying for him. Intercession of saints posits that you pray for him, that dead people can pray for him. I don't believe that. Because it assumes that the dead person has the ability to view all prayers in different though, languages. So it's still intercession if you're praying to someone else. Right? That's not, the Bible's not against intercession. The Bible, the Bible is against prayer to saints who are dead. Yeah, but isn't the uh, Roman Catholic saying, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners? Now, now where is Holy Mary, Mother of God? Where is it? No, where is she? Where is Holy Mary, Mother of God? Okay, well, she's not alive. Yeah, okay, that. so this is praying for the dead. This is resurrected dead. According to, to the dead, oh, according to First Samuel yeah. 28, praying for the dead is called divination. So it's very clear, this is divination. You should do it. They're doing divination, therefore they're heresy. Again, I, if I pray for you, there's not divination. You've asked me to pray for you, and I pray for you, you're not conscious. Do I don't think it's intercession. The, the point I'm trying to make to her is that intercession, in their view, is that you pray to Mary and then she prays to God on your behalf. Mary is not alive. If I intercede for you on earth, I am alive, you are alive. I'm communicating to God on your behalf. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm praying for me. Yes, yes. Yes, which is what Martin Luther came along and said, why you going to the cross? He wasn't Mary at that time. Well, Martin Luther was a Catholic. 
Yeah, yeah, Martin Luther was a couple. I, I'm, I'm not in agreement with Martin Luther. I think a lot of the times people have got our tradition wrong. Started the Reformation. No, no, he didn't start the Reformation. In fact, people were for him. The one does. Okay, he was around. He was around. He was around the time. The time that it was happening. He was in lieu of the speech of it, but he didn't start it. When he nailed the Knights of Pieces to the door of Wittenberg, that didn't change anything. And he was from a He didn't want the church to win. Well, Peter Walder was beautiful. You know what? It was a team. Sorry. You're okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. who has heard of the Michaela Community School and what's happening at the Michaela Community School? Put your hands up. What is happening at the Michaela Community School is that a head teacher, for the sake of the peace of her school, had to ban Muslim prayer. She had to ban Muslim prayer because through it, certain students who appear to have been radicalized by radical parents were starting to bully and intimidate other students to keep Islamic practices, even though, ladies and gentlemen, even though they didn't want to. Like other Muslim students, yes, in including Muslim girls who didn't want to wear the hijab or Muslim boys and girls who didn't want to do the fast. And they were being empowered because they were using the prayer as a form of uh, enticement and coercion to other Muslim students in that school. The Muslim community or aspects and members of the Muslim community were intimidating and harassing the school because they didn't have the facilities to give the Muslims a prayer room, were allowing the Muslims to pray in the yard, the school playground. And for that reason, a hate campaign of intimidation, including racial abuse, vandalism, death threats, were being sent to the school and directed to teachers at the school. Racial abuse of black teachers. Yes, racial abuse of black teachers happening by members of the Muslim community against the Michaela school. This episode doesn't sit in isolation. Put your hand up if you know about the Batley Community School and what happened there. There, a teacher wanted to give a talk, a lesson about blasphemy. And they used an example of the cartoons of Muhammad which Muslims consider blasphemy as an example of what blasphemy looks like. The result of that was that that teacher faced death threats and has now been in hiding for two years. Two years, ladies and gentlemen. Who knows about what happened to the pupil at the Wakefield School? So there was a child that brought a Quran into school as part of a dare and in some type of scuffle with other pupils, the Quran fell to the floor and was smudged on its outside cover. This resulted in death threats and intimidation against the boy and their family. And then the police, listen to this, the police dragged that family into the mosque to give a public apology. Ladies and gentlemen. One second. And then, and then recorded what the child did as a hate, non-hate crime. 
The Leighton School, Steve, what happened there? Tell everybody. Loud and clear. Primary school in Leighton. No, it's just some pure to emotion as well. For obvious reasons, I love this. the school said we don't want kids coming in wearing political flags, badges and stuff. And the kids all of a sudden start coming with yeah, Palestinian yeah, yeah. flags. The fact is, the when we think of ecumenism, we've got to understand that these churches are different. They are different because they teach different things. They do not teach the same thing. And if you are a Protestant believer in the Bible, so and you believe that the Bible is a sole authority for the church, the then the Catholics and the East Orthodox are your enemies. And if the Roman Catholics are your enemies, they are not, they are not Christians. And the school has a policy in which you pronounce that where it is. Would you pronounce that? Would you I like how Bob is able to tell me. Ecumenism is not able to deal with the arguments we suggest. Second question, I don't know what's going on there. Infighting Christians. Christians are infighting.
Yeah. 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 The church is those who affirm the doctrines of grace, faith alone, by grace alone, in Christ alone. The Bible is the Bible. This is a refute. They want us to run. The devil's on the They want us to run. Why are you going to shout to the Bible says. Make sure you get good pictures of people that come here with their faces.